Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. And you know, it's going to be a great video when you see this. So I have a little something different and planned for this video. So what I'm gonna do is I'm going to swatch them really quickly and then I want to do a design on my nails. I kind of have this design in my head, but you would see it on the picture. But anyway, so quickly swatching and then going to do the design. And this is their new macaroon collection. Now I have to say Madam Glam has knocked it out of the park with their last like six or seven releases I feel like. Like I just feel like they just, they hit it out of the park. So this is the Macaroon. And I do have a discount code but usually they're running a sale greater than my discount code but I do like to state that I do have one. Um, and so let's get into swatching. First up, we have Candyland. Next up is Blueberry Cream. Huh. Next up is I Lime You. Next up is Lemon Pie. Next up is Raindrop. Okay, I need this on my nails right now. Cherry Petals. Viola. Next up is Primavera. Spring in Paris. Ooh, okay, yes. Next up is Sweetness. Last but not least, we have Funfetti, which is their confetti. No wipe top coat. Do we see that? I know it's kind of hard to tell with my lights. I'm obsessed. Now the last collection, which was Jackpot and then the Pudding Gels was amazing. Like that Jackpot collection, yes. However, I think this one, it will be good for kind of overall. Like it's not a specialty polish, it's just a standard, you know, pastel rainbow and you guys know how I feel about pastel like bright pastel colors because like I have the light elegance as paints and I kept saying I really wish I had gel polish in those paints <laughs> yeah y'all I'm really excited for this okay guys thank you guys so much for watching this half let's get to the next half All right, now we are going to take our two colors and we are going to ombre. Now, what I like to do when I don't have an ombre brush, which I still have not gotten one, so I'm going to ombre with the two gel polishes and the brush that it comes with, which I know isn't necessarily the easiest for everybody, but what I like to do is when I put it on, I try to do half the nail and then I do the other half with the second color like I'm doing here, and then I will end up pretty much taking the brush and going semi flat to the nail. So I'm kind of just dragging it down to get that initial blend. And when I find going back and forth between the colors, it blends. You're not wanting to keep a ton of product on your nail. You'll see I wipe off the brush most of the time, A, because I think a lot of product stays in the brush, but highly recommend doing that. And then I'm going to take a detailer brush and fix any little areas. Okay, so that one is cured. And I'm coming in again. This time I'm starting with orange. There's no rhyme or reason for which way I start because literally you can go either way. But since I started with pink, I think I went with orange the second time. I feel like that's what my mind was saying at like 11 o'clock at night when I was filming these. <laughs> so you can see I'm just slightly moving it over and my brush is pretty flat. It doesn't look very flat here, but it is pretty flat. 
And like I said, these suckers hold a lot of polish, even though I wiped it out. So again, just swiping them back and forth, and then I am going to cure them. And these are ombre. I feel like if I make it brighter, you can't see it. If I make it darker, you can't really see it either. So it just needs a top coat, and I think I'm gonna do the Funfetti top coat. Hold me close till I get up. Time is barely on our side. I don't wanna waste what's left. The storms we chase are leading us. And love is all we'll ever trust. Yeah. No, I don't wanna waste what's left. And on and on we'll go through the wastelands, through the highways, till my shadow turns to sun rays. And on Funfetti, which I know is the moment you have all been waiting for. So this is a no wipe top coat. So give this a cure. And then you are good to go. I do recommend with this top coat is to do one at a time because I'm the type of person that likes to kind of move around my glitter and I did all of these at the same time. So I'm doing this, that, like do it one at a time. If you're like me, just really add something but 
does not take away from this ombre. So I hope you guys liked this tutorial and thank you again, Madam Glam, for sending me these colors. I am thoroughly obsessed because who does not like a pastel rainbow ombre? All right, guys, go ahead and give this video a thumbs up and subscribe and I'll catch you in the next one. Bye-bye. All right, here we go. I love a good ombre. And I want to thank Madam Glam again for sending these to me. And I do have my discount code and I will link it below. But I always say this, they generally have a better sale going on. But I still like to point it out. I'm obsessed. And these are perfect for St. Patrick's Day, actually. All right, thank you guys so much for watching. Go ahead and give this video a thumbs up and subscribe. And I'll catch you in the next one. Bye-bye.